Using brain scans, researchers have revealed that sleep inertia can cause reduced cognitive performance. In other words, it can hinder your brain functions by lowering your comprehension skills, which increases the time it takes for you to react to the world around you. Sleep inertia occurs when you enter deep sleep, but wake up before finishing the sleep cycle. To study its effects, the researchers followed 34 participants. They measured their brain activities before and after a 45-minute nap. The results showed that cognitive performance decreased soon after waking up. Those who awakened from a deeper sleep experienced bigger drops in performance, showing diminished short-term memory, counting skills, and thinking abilities. However, this drop lasted only for 25 minutes after waking up. This drop in brain performance during sleep inertia was linked with an increased delta brainwave activity, which is recorded within electroencephalogram, or EEG, during deep sleep. The team also found that working connectivity between brain networks received the biggest disruption right after awakening from the nap. It is known that it takes 25 to 30 minutes to reach deep sleep. Therefore, scientists recommend to take naps that are shorter than 25 minutes or full 90 minute naps to complete the sleep cycle. Neutralizing, or at least limiting, the effects of sleep inertia is possible, but little is known about the subject matter, making it more of a hit and miss process. For instance, ingesting caffeine before napping can limit the effects of sleep inertia, but the mechanisms that control that behavior are still unknown. Your body goes into maintenance mode when you go to sleep. This helps your body to recover and repair cells and other functions. This maintenance mode breaks down when your sleep gets interrupted. Therefore, it is better to wake up at the end of a sleep stage rather than in the middle. But beware that using a regular alarm clock to wake up every morning can increase your chances of experiencing sleep inertia by up to 90%. Alarm clocks can't tell what stage of sleep your body is in, and they have a 45% chance of waking you up from REM or deep sleep, with a 49% chance of waking you up from non-REM sleep, leaving only a small chance that a standard alarm clock will wake you up during the optimal moment of the sleep stage. The team found that the cognitive skills of participants in the study slightly deteriorated after waking up rather than after being deprived of sleep for an extended period of time. They compared the effects of sleep inertia to being as bad or worse than being drunk. Though the most serious effects of sleep inertia usually faded away within the first 25 minutes after waking up, the effects have been detected to linger on for up to two hours. The study shows just how much we still have to learn about even the most basic of bodily functions.